Hello and welcome to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Lauren and if you're not new, thanks for coming back. Today we have something, oh I'm so excited for. I just got this in the So today, I am so excited. I just got this in the mail. Katie will be helping with the unboxing process, but we have this quarters. Ugh, fat fit fun. <laughs> um, so it's in a very large and heavy box. And this is the summer quarter, I believe. Or is it spring? I don't even know. It'll tell us when we open it up. <laughs> I'm so excited. I just recently resubscribed to FabFitFun. I had taken a little bit of a break from it just because I had so much stuff and I was like, I, I don't need more stuff, <laughs> but I really missed it. I think FabFitFun is one of the better subscription boxes and I like that you have an option to choose what's in it and you can add a bunch of fun stuff into it. Anyways, it's always a good time. I wasn't super stoked on last season's box. That was the winter box, I believe. It was a little bit boring. It was a little boring. So I'm really hoping that this season's box is gonna be a little more inspiring, a little more creative, and uh, yeah, a little more entertaining. Before we open it up, just so you know a little bit more about FabFitFun, it's a seasonal subscription where you can get six to eight full-size items for $49.99. Now, that price is if you pay annually, which would be $199.99. But if you decide you only want to sign up and pay for it seasonally, then it would be $54.99. Yeah, and then it's billed quarterly, uh, which is actually what I do because I wasn't sure if I was going to keep on doing it. Kind of depends on how well this box is going to do. So let's open it up and see what's in it. So when I open it up, the first thing I see is the magazine that they always insert in there. And I was right. This is the summer edition. Whew, okay. I know my seasons. Cute. And it says summer is here. And it just tells you what's in your box, like what it's for, how to use it, if it's a beauty or skin or hair product, uh, which is actually kind of cool. So so you can kind of get an idea of what's in there. Um, I don't want to look too much at this because I don't want to spoil what's inside my box. I just want it to be fresh and new. Um, they also included some cute little stickers, so that's super cute. Okay, so I know a bunch of this is my add-ons. Okay, so first let's take a look on what I chose for add-ons because I did go a little crazy in the add-on section this time. Um, I love... Cocoa floss, and I love the coconut flavor. I guess it is a flavor if it's going in your mouth. Um, so I got two of these just to restock on my on my floss. You know, it's always a good thing to floss. So I got a couple of these, and then I got more floss. So they had a little tropical trio. Um, so I picked up more floss, and you know what? I think there was more floss. Oh, yeah. There was more floss, so I also got it in mint. So I am like so set on floss for a little while, but I love that they have those as add-ons because I will always get them. <laughs> um, I also got as an add-on, I was actually so excited to see this in their add-on section, but I got the Veil Soft Focus Setting Spray from Hourglass. I have been eyeing this for a while and it's so crazy expensive. It's like $50 normally, and I think I got it for 30. Um, in the add-on section. So still a little bit expensive for a setting spray, but really excited to have it. Okay, I also got these stacking canisters from Material Kitchen, because uh, I thought they looked cool. I don't remember what they look like now. Let's open it up, maybe. Ooh. Okay, they're just cute little glass canisters. Yeah, I can definitely find a use for these. There's two of them in there, so that was also one of my add-ons. I'll just put you back here. And then last but not least, I also just got some more bobby pins. I don't know where mine go. They disappear. Uh, so whenever I see uh, like blonde colored bobby pins, I always pick these up. So excited for those. Let's get into what is in my box. I'm super excited. It looks like there's some good stuff in here. And we're going to start off with the Way Scalp and Body Scrub. And I think this was one of the options that I could choose. I'm pretty sure it's been a while since I made my choices. Um, but I actually love the way this stuff smelled. So I was super stoked to see that it would be included in my box. Um, I use it as a body scrub, not so much in my hair, but for my body. 
And again, I just love the way that whey products smell. So I'm really excited that this was in my box. What's next? Oh, okay. We got a candle from Lasting Smiles and it is sea salt and citrus. So here's what the packaging looks like. And then let's take a look at what the actual candle looks like. Let's give it a sniff. Okay, so this is what the candle looks like. Mmm, it smells really good. <laughs> yeah, that smells amazing. It definitely smells like the seaside, a little bit perfumey, but also a little bit salty. I am excited to burn that. I am like one of those people that just has like a million candles. Um, I'd be embarrassed, but I just love them so much. Like, I love candles. Okay, next we have a body scrubber from Kayo. I don't think this was one of my choices. Oh, interesting, okay. It's like literally like a little body pad scrubber. Interesting. I might have to look and see exactly how that's supposed to be used, but yeah, okay, interesting. But that's another item that we have in the box. Oh no. So <laughs> next we have something from Ray Dunn. It's the Guac and Salsa Bowl set. So this is what the box looks like. I don't think I chose this. Um, I have been seeing quite a bit of Ray Dunn at my TJ Maxx and it always kind of cracks me up because, you know, like I was, there was a coffee cup that said tea, but I'm like, what if you want coffee in your, in your cup? Um, it's just kind of cracks me up. I kind of hope one of them doesn't say guac and one of them says salsa, but I'm betting you since it's Ray Dunn, that's what is going to happen. Okay. So it comes with two little wooden spoons, which is cute. And yep. One says salsa. And what says guac? Oh, Ray Dunn, you are predictable. These are actually pretty cute and we do eat quite a bit of Mexican food in my house. So I will probably be able to find some use for these. I'm not gonna lie, it might not always be salsa and guac going in there. It might be cheese or it might be, I don't know, something else, fried beans or something. Um, but they'll definitely get some use because I like the little wooden spoonies they come with, that's cute. Okay, next in our box, we got something from Alterna, which is the Caviar Anti-Aging Moisture CC Cream. So this is what it looks like. And I haven't tried this product before, but I have tried other products from this line. I think I've tried a couple um, shampoos and conditioners and some dry shampoo. And I'm not gonna lie, I don't love how this line smells. So let's see, it's supposed to go on your hair. Apply evenly to clean, towel dry hair, and style as desired. Yeah, so since it's a hair product, I'm sure it's going to have that same smell. I'll probably be able to get some use out of it still. Um, but maybe I'll see if my mom is interested in something like this. Because it's just, I just don't love it. It's just a little bit smelly. Okay, next we have something from Soar. And it is a desk pad. This is what it looks like. Oh, and it's literally just... You unroll it, it's just a mat for your desk, the work at home area. You can bring it to work. I definitely don't think I picked that, especially since I'm not currently working. <laughs> okay, interesting. I'm not sure how much use I'm gonna get out of this one, but interesting product. And last, we have a little bralette from Free People. Let me take it out of the plastic. I love Free People's bralettes, so I was really excited to see that this was an option. It just looks like this. Super cute. I am really glad that I have this. Okay, so that's what was in our summer box. We have the guac and salsa set. We have the Alterna Caviar Anti-Aging Cream that goes on your hair. We have this little matte thing for your work area. We have the little bralette from Free People. We have the body scrubber from Kayo. And we have the very, very amazing smelling candle sea salt and citrus from Lasting Smiles. Um, so that looks like that's all that was in our box this time. Now, what are my thoughts and opinions? Mm, it's like a 50-50 for me. I really liked all the add-ons I was able to snag with this box. And I do like the candle, the bralette. You know what, I'm gonna give Ray Dunn a pass because this is a pretty cute set, guac and salsa. Um, but I don't know if I'm going to get any use out of these two products and for the body scrubber, I'm not entirely sure how much use I'm going to get out of that. So for $54, mm, I am not 
100% sure how much I love this box. It was, we got some interesting stuff in here, but I just remember when FabFitFun first came out, they not only had more products in their boxes, but I just felt like they were more interesting products. And I felt like they really fit the theme of the box a lot better. For a summer box, I kind of expect to see something more summer related in this box. So instead of something like the desk pad, maybe include a towel, which would be fitting for summer. Um, I don't hate it, but I don't love it. Am I going to get next season's box? Yes, I think I'm going to continue to get these boxes because I do love opening them. This is kind of the only subscription box that I have right now. And I will give it another try. Fingers crossed that the next box is a little better. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for watching. If you haven't had a chance already, please subscribe. I am trying to get to 500 subscribers before the end of the year. I think that's totally doable. Please subscribe if you haven't already. And I look forward to seeing you in the next video. Bye.